again, key for him is just staying back, not overthrowing the baseball, work down in the zone, sink the fastball, use his very good curveball. He's got an excellent changeup, especially for a young pitcher to be able to throw back-to-back -back changes to a changeup in a fastball count is very impressive. Matt Washington's done a tremendous job, as Mike Sosha has done with his team. In the air to center field, Gary Matthews playing center tonight. Injuries will stop him, even though he's hitting 324. He has 170 hits. And Abreu tried to sell that one, but didn't catch it. Hop fly left field. Reggie Willits moves over. And the interesting thing here, too, for the Rangers is they're still alive in the wild card chase. A slow roller over the mound out to Brandon Wood. This throw to first is in time. Good ERA overall, too. This guy has a fastball 88 to 92. He's also got a cut fastball, a curveball, and a changeup. 3-0 against the Halos this year. Right back to the mound. Two down. And there's a the fly ball into right field. That sends Nelson Cruz to the warning track. To the wall. It's over his head. And that ball is off the wall. Home run. It came back to the right fielder. Home run for Bobby Abreu. He got it out. Number 15 on the year, and it's 1-0 Angels. Boy, I think you're seeing that a Bobby of late, too. Not only getting some hits, getting a swing back, but also extra base hits. It's excellent. You can see right there a fastball. He wanted to turn it over a sinker, but it was elevated. And Bobby able to get the big part of the bat and drive it out. Vladdy hits one back to the mound. Let the Angels get the early lead on a home run by Bobby Abreu. That, for me, was one of the most amazing, touching things I've ever seen, not only in baseball, in all of sports. This is spontaneity to go up there and do that for their friend, their teammate, their brother. I didn't find anything particularly inappropriate about that. There's a fly ball to shallow right field. Bobby Abreu makes the catch. Howie Kendrick takes care of Nelson Cruz, and the Rangers are out. In and Gary hit by the pitch. With the runner going, Howie hits a ground ball right to Andrews. He stepped on second too late. Hard shot to third, caught by Young. Jeff Mathis up there. Yeah, baby. Shot up the middle, gets through. Gary Matthews is at third. Here he comes to the plate. He will score two to nothing Angels. Now Mathis heading to second. He's in there. Well, on a lot of fronts, that was great base running by the Angels. Gary Mathis, of course, scoring on that base hit up the middle. Brandon Wood recognizing a young player in center field. He went first to third on that when clearly the center fielder, Gentry, sees that, can throw to third, maybe able to get the out of third before the run scores across the plate. A he draws a walk, and that loads the bases for the Angels. Starting out of that bullpen, maybe three, four innings, and, of course, sprinkling the starters a couple innings. Mike. Reggie hits a liner into right field, but Cruz will catch it. And the Angels leave the bases loaded in the second inning. Halo's leading at 2 nothing. And Pudge goes down swinging right here. He lines it to right. Bobby Abreu makes a nice grab. Good fastball by O'Sullivan. Strikes him out. Two strikeouts in the inning for Sean and a one, two, three, third. And lined into right field by Abreu. Right to Cruz. And Vladdy lines one into right field. A base hit for Vlad Guerrero. And I think he would probably even have welcomed a trade somewhere. There's a line drive into right field for Gary. Base hit. As it turns out, there were some injuries. He came back from AAA. So it's the adjustments you make mentally in this game. Howie, uh, half a swing there, strikes him out. Two down. Quinlan hits a pop fly, shallow left field. Murphy comes in and makes the play to retire the side.
Toronto again tonight. Strike three to Michael Young. He's still in good position to make that play. Murphy drives one to right field. David Murphy hits it way out, and the Rangers are on the board. Pretty impressive at bat. But Murphy fouled off some tough pitches, a number of pitches. It was Sullivan was hitting the spot, fouled them off, fouled them off, then got a pitch to drive and hit it way out the right field. That's his 17th of the season. And it's two to one, Angels. Won it inside on that fastball, but it ran out. That's the danger of a two seam fastball that has that run action middle part of the plate. Murphy didn't miss that pitch. And the fly ball hit well by Gentry to center field. Gary Matthews makes the catch. Blaylock rolls one to second base, and Kendrick throws him out. But and there's a shot into center field. That sends Gentry way back. It's over his head. It's off the wall. Brandon Wood, a double. Off the end of the bat, right back to Feldman. And it's a four-pitch walk for Figgins, number 101 on the season. And Reggie takes a call, third strike. Ground ball towards first, backhanded nicely by Blaylock. But what a great race that is. Napoli strokes a base hit into left field that's going to knock in two. Pinch hit single for Mike Napoli, two RBIs for Nap. Four to one, Angels. Pop fly is going to take care of Matthews and the Angels. Behind third and just off the end of Sandoval's glove. It's a base hit for Kinsler. It'll be a double for Ian. A high chopper behind second base. Brandon Wood. Good throw. Hard hit ground ball to Wood. He goes to first for the out. Kinsler scores from third. Pudge gets an RBI, and it's four to two Angels. On the ground to third base, Sandoval stays with a tough hop and gets him. But they are, you would have to say, not fed up with winning division titles, but they're certainly tired of getting knocked out early. I firmly believe the way they're playing right now, they're in position to be able to do so. Here's the one-two pitch to Brandon Wood, and he'll be called out on strike. Orbon taps one toward first base. Quinlan's still in there, and he feeds Rodriguez for the out. Michael Young with a base hit into center field. Ground ball, base hit into right field. David Murphy having a good day, has a home run and a single now. Well, he probably won't because the fact is he has some guys still playing all the way through the end of the season. So it's a, it's a tough call, but I called it. And there's a liner to center field. Willits comes on and makes the sliding catch. That gets Rafael Rodriguez out of the sixth inning. Get a chance to pitch in the postseason. Guys like Bobby Wilson get the chance to see this. Wilson lines one into right center field, but it's an out as Gentry makes a nice play. Craig Gentry got a good jump on that line drive. He's trying to put up numbers. Terry Evans grounds one to shortstop. Two down. And he draws a walk. And Sandoval hits a fly ball into left field. That'll be it for the inning home against Milwaukee. There's a drive by Kinsler into left center field. Cruising over to make the catch, Terry Evans. Wide of third, the play made by Freddie Sandoval. And if those don't feel like household names to you, this game does have a decidedly spring training feel to it right now, but that's
Good play on the right side by Howie Kendrick, and he gets him. Nice play by Howie. Strike three call. We saw Strope uh, last night. He was impressive. For about 70 games, he over 300. And there's a line drive. Base hit. First major league hit for Chris Pettit. Two and two to Howie Kendrick. And Howie hits one past Young at third down the line. Here's Pettit getting to third base, turning and going home to score the run. Big night for Chris Pettit. Five to two Angels. One and one to Rob Quinlan. Good play made by Ian Kinsler at second base to take a hit away from Q. And Woody goes down swinging to retire the side. And I'll tell you, interviewing Mike Butcher after the ball game as Gerardano gets a strikeout. That, that is still a great feel. I still get goosebumps when you look at that. Top fly to right field by Bourbon. Two out from the dugout. Remember, they interviewed him right after it happened. And he was a member of the New York Mets. Strike three call to Michael Young. Great inning for Arredondo. Fountain Valley. There's a shot by Bobby Wilson in the left field for a hit into the corner. Angel catcher Bobby Wilson a double. And down he goes. Popped up. And Kinsler takes care of it. 2-0 to Sandoval. He hits a high fly ball into right center field. Nelson Cruz puts it away. And a slow roller to Howie Kendrick. Good play made by Howie. No. <laughs> you had to think about that one? Yeah. I don't think they're at Fenway, no. Two outs as Sandoval makes that play. Fuente strikes him out looking, and the ball game is over. Brian Fuentes gets the save. Sean O'Sullivan gets the win. First major league hit for Chris Pettit tonight. Just another halo victory. And not one walk by Angel Pitchers tonight attacking that strike zone. So we talked about the three phases coming together at the right time.